Hey guys, this is Dorsa, and we're back into our Southampton career mode on FIFA 14. And I think I'm going to start doing these episodes a bit different now, and possibly start putting in two or three games in each episode to make them a bit longer. So in this episode, I'm probably going to try and put in this away game to Norwich in the Premier League, and then we've got a, a Capital One Cup game away to Chesterfield as well. And also, I'm just looking at the table after two games. Uh, currently in sixth, but I think the overall goal really is to get better than the Southampton team in the real world. I think they're currently in eighth place in the Premier League, I think. So yeah, hopefully we can stay above eighth for the rest of the season. So yeah, let's get into this match away to Norwich. We've, had, we've been uh, getting some early goals so far in this career mode. So hopefully we can get another early goal today. Go send Alana away down this wing. I think he's scored in both the games so far. Can he get another one here? Yes, he can. Three goals in three games for Alana now. Great start for him. Just runs in the box again, like this goal in the last game. Just no one made a tackle on him. Alana overlapping. Speed into the box again. Sends it across this time. Ings is there. Good save from the keeper. Oh no. That was a good chance for them. The keeper does well. Shaw linking up there with Lambert. There's Shaw. Carries on. Good cross. Ings header. Oh, off the post. What the hell's happened here? Are they giving a penalty for that? I don't see how this is a penalty. Oh, that's a bit stupid if they score from this. Come on, save it. Oh, he's missed it. Clear it. Clear it. Ings chips a through ball over. Lambert got pulled back a bit there, but still fights his way to the ball. Keeps it in. Cross. Rodriguez. Ah. Oh. oh no, Lovren's giving it away. Lucky to get away, away with that one. Here's Rhodes. Trying to get his first goal for Southampton. No. Always oh, won it back. Shot. Blocked again. Good save, and then defending from Norwich to stop Rose from scoring. And there we go, that's full time. Just squeezing out a 1-0 victory away to Norwich. Not too bad of a result. At least it's three points from away, from an away game. And we just had transfer deadline day right after that match and the only deal that happened involving us was uh, we sold the centre back who we fell, I don't know how you pronounce that. We just sold him to West Brom for 775000 uh, yeah, I wasn't going to use him, so he was just taking up some of the wage budget and just got a bit of extra money from him. This might get a replacement in the Janu January <laughs> window. But yeah, let's get into this second game for this episode, which is the first cup game of the season away to Chesterfield. And here we go, kicking off the first cup game of the season. I have have rotated the squad quite a bit. I'm just keeping in uh, Lalana and uh, Borup, the goalkeeper. I think they're the only two from the starting 11 against Norwich that have stayed in, so just resting the rest of the players. It's Alana instantly down this side. Can't go cross in. Oh, the keeper made a mistake there. I think he's put it into his own net. But I think the goal's gone to. I think that's Rhodes. First goal for Southampton. That was a terrible mistake by the keeper there. Slips out of his hands. And it just hits Rhodes and goes slightly. Well, the whole ball just manages to go over the line before they clear it. Bit of a fluky goal, but 1 0. I think it came off his arm as well. Oh, but horrible defence from Chesterfield. They've left Davis loads of space. Runs in 1 on 1. Shoots. 2 0. Inside 10 minutes. Davis with the second. The Chesterfield defence just left a gap wide open to play a through ball. One of the keeper smashes it into the bottom corner. 
captain cuts back. Takes a shot, edge of the box. Good save from the keeper. Oh, they've got a good chance here. Goalkeeper saved it, but it went right back to the Chesterfield player. Smashed it into an open net. Poor defence there from Southampton. Davis, corner in. Yoshida. Good save. The keepers try and make up for that mistake earlier. Lana sends this one in. Fonts there. Off the bar. Oh, one of Yama's nicked it back. Through ball to Rhodes. Oh, how has he not finished that? His finishing has been awful this season so far. He got a goal earlier, but that just deflected off of his arm into the net. I don't know how it's not 3 1 at the moment. We probably could have scored two more in that first half. Had a couple of other chances. Hit the bar. Rose missed the sitter. Finish our chances better in the second half, hopefully. Oh, but here's one. The line has found some space. It's got to send across the first time. Oh, it's found its way to Rose. Turns and shoots. Good block. Oh, no. The keeper's giving it right away. Oh, good block. I think that was Font. Yep. He's been out of the squad since I brought in Kabul, but that was a great slide in to block that. Terrible kick from the keeper right to the uh, Chesterfield striker. They've got a corner there. Oh, Wanyama's found Davis. Great pass. Davis has got a break away from the defender, though. Can he send in a good cross? Gag is there. Poor finish. Bit of a difficult header to get onto, but still way wide. We're in stoppage time. I don't know whether that was a shot or a through ball, but it didn't work. Straight to the keeper. Waste some time before we boost it clear. And that's the full time whistle. We've gone into the next round of the Capital One Cup. I think it should have been more like 4 1, but. Chesterfield defended well in the second half. 2 1's enough though. But I'll do for this fourth episode. As I said at the start, I'm going to try and carry on putting in two or three episode, uh, matches into each episode. Uh, so I'm going to try and carry that on. But until next time, thanks for watching. See you in the next video.